We did an island hopping tour one time, and we did all these interesting things that were, you know, great money things, but didn't require a big national touring company because we couldn't have gotten one. Didn't require a record label because we really couldn't get the backing of mm-hmm. one. Uh, we would play these cool beach venues like the uh, the Florabama. Have you guys ever been to the Florabama? No. It's on the Alabama Great Club. A buddy of mine, Joe Gilchrist, owns it down there. Still, He still has it. It's right on the Florida-Alabama state line on the beach. Okay. Known for its uh, annual interstate mullet toss. <laughs> so you uh, you go down there, you drink a whole lot of cheap beer, and you take mullets, you know, the fish, and you, mm. there's a line drawn uh, in sand on the state line, and it's like a discus. You know, you, you how far can you throw the mullet? I, I was I was th- thinking you were throwing, you know, these guys with mullets. These, mm, these guys guys well, there was a lot of them, and there <laughs> right? still are to this day, I guarantee you. So you got, just... you got kind of a combination, <laughs> mullet squared going on down Dude, there. Dude, I hadn't even thought about it. You're right, though. Yeah, it, mullet squared. To this day, I bet that's one of the greatest collection of people with mullets <laughs> On the planet, and but it's you know this club's been there. The place has been there forever and ever and ever. It's always packed out. It's been taken out since I've known Joe. It's been taken out by I think three hurricanes wow. and re- totally wow. rebuilt. And uh, I remember back when we first went there, back in uh, I think 1985 was probably the first time I walked in that place. Uh, the the literally the building is on the state line. The front door. Uh, half the front door was in Alabama, half was in Florida, and you they had these two pay That's phones, cool. one on this side, one on that side. One had the was in Alabama, yeah. and so people would come in there and they would take pictures of themselves making long distance phone calls to themselves. <laughs> now you tell me that's not redneck, and I was one of them that did. I was one of the first ones in line to do it. So like, I got to do that too. Well, I go it's back like a Polaroid to, picture. Yeah, I go back to eighty five. That's that was about the, the one of the last years I, I sported my mullet. I got married that year, but I remember I had had a mullet then. <laughs> I had, a, I, had a, I had a, you know, a king mullet, and you know, before that, and probably 80, 82, 3, 4, I had this big, big flat top. Are you serious? Oh, yeah, I had a flat top and the oh, mullet dude. in the back. So I, you know, I had business up on top, and what do they call that? How do they say that? <laughs> party in the front. But, well, I, I think it was more party in the back, you know, a little business, <laughs> business up front and party in the back I had going on. But then uh, by the time I got married, you know, Cheryl had, had uh, gotten that uh, tamed a little more, but still had the mullet at, at, in did, 85. Did Cheryl make you cut it off before the wedding pictures, or did you just hide it? No, she she did, she did uh, it was still going on, but she could take pictures without seeing it too much, you know. Oh, my God. But, but then I messed everything up, and I grew the first and only mustache I, I've had in my life for our wedding day. Really? Oh, oh yeah. man. I never had never had a mustache only in my life except that that you know that time. Did you have one of those ones that came with down like that? Can no, like a, not a Fu Manchu. No? This, this is uh, this is more of a uh, this is more like a Miami Vice like mustache. Gotcha. So, okay. Did you have look, the glasses? No, did, didn't have. Did I, glasses? I had a members only jacket. Though. Oh, okay. All right. Very Tom Selleck of you. But anyway, you just think of '85 for sure. That on the beach that when you were there at, at uh, oh, yeah. Flor, what do you call it, Floribama? The Floribama. Floribama yep. definitely mullet squared. You got Man, the mullets is... in the water and the mullets on the beach. Yeah. I like it.